Hello everyone, this is Ari from RS Communication. In this video, I'm going to unpack and review TP-Link router. This is advanced and router 300 Mbps. The model number as you see TLWR841N. I have one more router here. As you see, this is 150 Mbps. This is TLWR740. In the next video, I'm going to unpack and review this one. Now I'm going to review with 300 Mbps advanced router. For this, I need to cut this box. It's a nice looking box. It's packed. At the back side of the box, we have instruction. And as you see, this router is come with four port, four LAN port and one port is for connector. You have to connect with your modem in this port. And after that, you can use your tablet, phones, your PlayStation or Xbox and your computer, obviously. Okay. And some more instruction here is written the quality and the range of the 300 Mbps and 150 Mbps. So, okay, now I'm gonna cut this one. For this, I'm gonna use a blade. Okay, from here, I will put inside this blade and I will take by my hand. The packaging is good. So you must check when you buy. As you see, all the thing I have here, what I have, I have an installation CD, as you see, small one, put this one side, later we'll need that. A installation guide is in Spanish. Another guide of something, some license agreement Okay, from TP-Link, the adapter from TP-Link, it's a very light and high quality, the build quality is good, okay, what more we have, we have a LAN cable, 4.5 RJ cable, LAN ethernal cable, and we don't have nothing, only the router itself. And the antenna is connected surprisingly. Normally they are not connected in some old package. I unbox and I saw much heavier than the old versions. And we can move as this. Take this sticker out. And as you see four port, LAN port, that means you can connect four desktop PC or laptop PC by this. Here you have to put your WLAN connection, that means the internet connection direct from your modem. Here you have on off button is small, Wi-Fi on off button. Here you have one small reset button. Here we have power hole for the adapter. And this is the main power button on off. You can on off your router by this button. At the bottom what we have. We have two holes. If you want, you can hang at the wall. This one and write in the barcodes and MAC address and the power and all these things about this router. At the top, we have holes all around and the logo or mark of the TP-Link. We have so many lead indicator. The, this one is power, this one is setting, this one is Wi-Fi, this is internet and four desktop PC or laptop PC will indicate these leads. And we have one log. Is not so much heavy is light but not so much light either this is all my friend if you like this video please do subscribe if you have any question leave me as a comment i will try to answer you as much fast as possible in my next video i'm going to set up this router so wait for that thank you once again good night ciao